our lives are always changing and often in unexpected ways, but we are able to adapt and move on relatively easily. That's not always the case for our canine companions, and it's an important factor to consider, especially if your living or family situation tends to change often. Today we're going to look at how adaptable the Bull Mastiff is, and see how well they might handle your life changes. Welcome back to the Bull Mastiff channel. If this is your first time here, my name's Hattie. I'm a certified canine leader here at FenwayCanineLeaders.com, and this channel is dedicated to helping you learn everything you could possibly want to know about the Bull Mastiff, and then how to become high-level canine leaders that can raise the perfect Bull Mastiff. So if you're a lifelong Bull Mastiff lover, you're thinking about getting one, or you've just started your journey with your new Bull Mastiff, then this channel is for you. So make sure you hit that subscribe button and turn the notification bell so you never miss a future Bull Mastiff video. So let's dive into today's video, and we'll take a look at the adaptability of this huge breed. Our canine companions have little say in some of the changes that happen in our life, like having a baby, moving to a new home, or taking a job with longer working hours. We should of course consider the needs of our canines when making decisions that will impact them, but we're often put in those same situations at a moment's notice too. So how adaptable is the Bull Mastiff when it comes to changes in our lives? Let's find out. We'll dive right in and look at a key factor in adaptability, energy. The Bull Mastiff reaches maturity around three years of age, and with their puppy and teenage years coming to a close, their energy level does drop a little bit. They are generally a pretty low energy breed, but they will range closer to moderate energy for their first three years of life. They need an hour or so of exercise each day, so having a larger fence yard and larger home is ideal. Should your home and yard decrease in size, then you're going to have to be more dedicated to exercising them, but they adjust to smaller living remarkably well for their size. This could mean longer walks around the neighbourhood or easy brain games in the home, but you'll generally find the bull master to be quite happy as long as they're with you and their family. The Bull Mastiff is fairly trainable and willing to please their calm, consistent leader, which can come in handy when their life is uprooted. Obedience work is a great way to focus their mind and energy in new places where they need to ignore the new distractions, but they aren't overachievers in this area. They'll likely find a comfy spot with a view and carefully watch their new surroundings while keeping an eye on the family. Remember your Bull Mastiff's ancestors were bred to be estate guardians, so they prefer situations that are familiar so they can easily spot anything amiss. Keeping their routines as familiar as possible will help transition them into their new life, whether that be a new home, a new baby, or less time with you. The Bull Mastiff is a devoted family canine that thrives when someone is with them, but they are generally quite comfortable being alone too. It's still critical that you work on their confidence alone from an early age and build up the time that they're left alone rather than jump straight in. Bull Mastiffs are capable of destroying their kennel, chewing any number of things, and other destructive behaviours when they aren't trained to accept being alone. Moderate exercise, quality bonding, and crate training are going to be key in keeping your Bull Mastiff from developing separation anxiety. Since you never know when you might suddenly start working more or be home later, it's crucial that you teach this acceptance early on and keep this training maintained throughout the life of your Bull Mastiff. It will make many of life's changes easier for both your canine and you to adapt to at a moment's notice. Bull Mastiffs are incredibly devoted and affectionate with their family, so changes in their life that result in less time with you or the rest of their family are going to be the hardest for them to adjust to. If you've taken a job with longer hours and don't have a family member that can be there, you'll need to work harder when exercising and bonding with them in the morning and evening. If you or someone your Bull Mastiff trusts can be there for an hour or two in the middle of the day to give them some attention, then they'll likely adapt much more easily. As with most things, it's easiest to make the adjustment in stages if possible and get creative when making accommodations if it's not. Keep in mind that if you know a life change that will directly impact the amount of time you can spend with the Bull Mastiff is coming, start adjusting to the new routine as early as possible. Overall, the Bull Mastiff is one of the most adaptable large dog breeds out there, but you'll still want to train them in and for a variety of situations since it's impossible to know what changes you'll experience in their life. Their guarding instincts and sheer size are going to be two of your biggest factors when considering the overall adaptability of the Bull Mastiff, so start working on things early and then often throughout their life to make changes as easy on them and on you as possible. I hope you enjoyed today's video and if so make sure you hit that like button, get involved down in the comment section below and don't forget that if you're new here to make sure you subscribe, we have two dedicated Bull Mastiff videos coming here every week, so I can't wait to talk to you again on the next episode of the Fenrir Bull Mastiff channel.